Alexis Schwartz, volcanologist from Geo Tenerife, who's studying the volcano in La Palma, gave his seismologic assessment of the eruptions right now. The situation, as, uh, as you can see, is uh, we have an ongoing Strombolian eruption. Uh, it increases and decreases. Uh, it's got different phases along the day. So sometimes the intensity of the eruption, this means the, the amount of magma coming per unit time increases, and then it sort of comes down, but then it, it increases again. At the moment, we have an increasing phase, and in fact, a flank vent has opened up, and it's emitting quite a lot of uh, lava at the moment. So that is a, the new, a new vent that opened up yesterday, but it has had some uh, quite uh, placid kind of uh, behavior. But at the moment, just now, suddenly, after a big noise, this uh, new vent is uh, producing more, uh, has a more explosive behavior, uh, and it's emitting a lot of lava at the moment. So we have, as we can see it from here, two main vents at the top of the volcano and one flank eruption is ongoing at the moment. And it's been erupting for around a week now. Is there any idea of how long it could carry on for? No, no idea. And I have to tell you that uh, uh, the science of volcanology cannot predict how long the eruption is going to last, despite uh, what you may have heard somewhere. Uh, we don't know how, what, when the eruption is going to stop, and we don't know the evolution of the eruption. We don't know whether this eruption is going to increase in intensity or decrease. The, 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 exact, the fact is that these phases are continuous. They, they are increasing. Uh, uh, there are phases where the intensity increases and then decreases and so on. This is a normal behavior in this type of eruptions. We can neither, but we cannot say when, how long the eruption is going to last, and we we, do, we cannot say in advance what the behavior of the eruption is going to be. The airport's being closed because of the ash. Thousands of people have That's been correct. evacuated. Is there a fear now that the lava could force more people from their homes in more densely packed areas? If the eruption continues, uh, as it uh, appears to be the case, most likely uh, the lava flows will continue advancing. And, yeah, more damage is going to uh, uh, happen. I mean, at the moment, the main lava flow, the, the lava flow that was emitted at the beginning of the eruption has flown down the hill and is pretty close to the coast, a couple of kilometers away. But now, because the area is flatter, then this advancing lava flow is, is kind of stopped. And the problem is that uh, it's now uh, spreading sideways. So therefore, it may affect areas that previously uh, were not thought to be affected. Uh, if we consider the main trajectory of the lava. So, yeah, I mean, the answer to that is yes, more damage is expected because I think this eruption is ongoing and it doesn't seem to be uh, decreasing in intensity, on the contrary.